Um, I will check the bracket, or it'll pull up in a second here. Smiggy versus Peels from UT. That's an Austin rip. That's cool. Anyway, Smiggy Rosa versus Peels. Sheep. Nice little Smash 4 matchup we got here. Oh, that's Oh. Um, a little neutral. Feeling each other out, throwing projectiles. Those feel like they're fighting a little bit for center stage. A little roll back roll in there. Heels backing up a little in the corner, but Sneaky over commits, so Heels gets a free punish and will now start his advantage. He's gonna try to kill Luma, but apparently it's impossible to hit. Oh, there we go. A lot of defensive play so far. Ninja player wants to see him to commit too much, but nice snare air there. Doesn't quite get the confirm. Probably need a fastball. Oh, doesn't. Doesn't click down B. Maybe he grabs the aerial on shield, just kind of waiting for him to land. That's not the hard part. Uh, Kiel's gotta find this kill and getting a little smash attack happy knows that this will be an issue. Yeah, just try to smash that that roll a little late. Thingy wants to slowly chip him back up, but not too far from being able to kill himself. We'll need to sit back a little bit here. Actually interesting how um Heels can't really, uh, Luma does get hit by the needles, but, oh yeah, unfortunate misinput. What I was gonna say is, Heels wants the needle, maybe to build up damage, but Luma kind of blocks that. Kind of hard to harass her from a range, and the down B can't prevent that a little bit too, although we haven't seen it yet. I think maybe that one side B I saw this thing he was a little bit the change. He may have wanted Luma to stay on the ground, but now that uh Luma sticks with Rosa, it went up in the air with him. But Heels keeping a good advantage here. Tracking up the damage. Miggy just not really finding a foothold in neutral here. Goes too high with that up B and can take more damage for it. He was getting pretty close to some kill confirms here. Uh, ain't alive himself. Hard to get Sheik at a disadvantage. Oh yeah, nice little mix up. Puts Luma on his shield and then just catches him jumping. Still, so, feels with a solid lead. Pass him a little bit. Uh, I don't think they'll time out, but he's pretty low clock here. Pretty patient game, just, you know, little chippets from Sheik constantly. I think he's waiting for his opening. Oh, catches the roll with that F smash, though. Not, not a roll you want to make after seeing that F smash so many times in a row. But this is looking pretty comfortable for Peels right now. Smiggy probably needs to change something out. If he can, he can maybe space some more aerials on shield. I've seen the aerials maybe be a little too full in, but if he can, he can threaten forward and then start threatening that shield and catch the movement after. Yeah, that was a better one. Oh, catches the jump, and yeah, nice early kill. We'll seal it out. Uh, he'll stay game one. We'll see what I happens in game two. Yeah, it took like an hour watching a guy get stung by a <laughs> Of like increasing pain. Okay. I don't know why we did that. I thought we did. Here we go to game two, though. Looks like we will go to Nashville. Speaking of the Smash 4 matchups, I don't know if Sneaky learned his lesson from that game. We can cheat to Smashville. Here we go. Yeah. Again, we are running Hazard Dawn. Today may, may, may be the last day of Hazard Dawn, but 
We're gonna rediscuss the stages after today. So, Heal's reaping the benefits here. But Sneaky's starting off already stronger than he did last game. And having that lead's gonna be huge against Sheik if she can't just shield camp and you know, push her frame date out. Yeah, again with that neutral beat up smash. But Sneaky missed the man again. This is where he struggled a little bit. And yeah, again. Heels doesn't try to push it. Sneaky going high, but Sheik's not gonna have trouble catching that. Maybe better against a slower character. But... Heels gets back first, but he's gotta hold on to his stock here. I do like how people just facing these hands. Not in too much of a rush to get this kill here. So, the needle just kind of surpassed the uh, down B. I I guess they lasted too long. Oh, aggressive charge. And I think he actually almost gets caught by it. Oh, he's going to go under. Actually, smart play. Does anything kill? No, not quite. But, good follow. Yeah, and air rounding because will take that stock and suddenly it's all even. Feels actually doing a good job of that some of the earlier kills here. Sneaky just chasing down fields and getting getting chipped a little bit every time he does. I'm not really sure what Rosa does to prevent it, so. Just so much mobility coming out of Sheik. Just need to position Luma right, I suppose. Yeah, Sneaky again, throwing out these aerials, hoping Peel jumps in, but Sheik's so fast that she can just whip punish from across the stage. Hey, some gameplay here. Both just waiting each other out. Sneaky, those, see, those upsides are seem impatient, but like, what can you do? This doesn't... Sheik's not gonna touch you. Just throw him out. That's safe. The game and watch an extra point. Oh, but gets in between Lose uh sorry, Rosalina and Luma. And that will spell another stop. Feels looking really good here. Alright, so you're trying to push that advantage to kill, but. Oh, actually, Luma came in, extended the hitbox, and uh, actually made uh, heels drop the combo. Alright, off stage here. Thingy can't quite finish it. And Sneaky really needs this kill here because he's coming up close to the end of them stalking. Punishes the high up B. Heels takes it solid 2-0. Yeah.